Hey y'all, I just figured, well, I'm in this getup already. Might as well do an unboxing. A twofer, you get a twofer. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna be unboxing one of my white elephant gifts that I got at a Christmas party recently. And uh, we're both in for a surprise because I have never seen something like this in my life. So, but again, it looks really nice. You can see uh, the brand is Nutriops. Nutriops? Nutriops? I have no clue. <laughs> but it looks nice and nice and fancy and sophisticated. It is a decanter decanter. It's made out of glass. Mm -hmm. It's hand blown. So let's give this a, a whirl and open her up. Shall we? Here goes the cellophane. Sometimes I'm like, should I do one of those ASMR things? I'm not 100% sure. But talk like I can't, I don't <laughs> I, I hear it's relaxing. I don't know. Ooh, so much cellophane. Cellophane. Oh Lord have mercy. Hold on a second. I need a pair of scissors. Okay. Why so much? I mean I get it. It's flat it's made out of glass, but come on, so much. Just, just just see my frustration here. Just see my frustration? Okay. Okay. That's a styrofoam. And, uh, yeah. Voila. There you go. Um, I'm going to Google the properties of the purpose of a decanter, but I'm under the assumption it just keeps the wine nice and chill. Even if you're sitting, if, if you're in the middle of dinner, you know, I don't know. I'll, I'll see the properties of it. It's very nice. It can dupe as a nice vase. <laughs> but I thought it was a really nice, sophisticated um, gift. So I am thankful. The, the packaging was a little much. But nonetheless, that's number one. Unveiling. Unveiling. I feel like Vanna White. Unveiling. Unveiling. Now for the really fun stuff, we're going to unbox, and I've been wanting to open this for over a week now. This is the Blockbuster Party Game. Tell me this isn't the cutest thing though. And I didn't even know there were commercials. Perhaps they might have seen it in passing as a kid, but not enough for me to be like oh i remember it's not so like known like uh i don't know tv tv series theme song so this is a first you can youtube this this is there's montages of it i didn't know there were commercials but it goes to show blockbuster video who remembers and tell me this isn't the cutest packaging it looks like a traditional vhs case tape um, that you would typically get at a blockbuster video store and uh, it is, this is by Big Potato Games so let's get into the uh, revealing of the package shall we this is so cute though uh, <laughs> when I saw it I saw it online I said oh that this goes perfect this goes perfect with the theme of what I'm already doing, movie reviews. Again, I might try this online. I might try this in person with people. We'll see if it, if it takes. If people want to participate, <laughs> I would. Oh, oh. Here we go. Oh, this is so adorable. Okay, I just want to do a comparison here. Okay, this is how... Okay, we're not really fully in yet. Okay, I just opened it. Check this out, though. <laughs> if you're in for a trip, you really want to get trippy right now. Hold on a sec. 
let's do a comparison, okay? These are one of my mementos. Again, I do have actually, I have actually bought or had in the past, have purchased movies from Blockbuster Video. And this is like when they want to retire the movie. And so you could get them for cheap. And so this is, uh, I still know what you did last summer. This was a sequel to I Know What You Did Last Summer. And uh, check this out. Okay, okay. You can't view this anywhere. I mean, nobody owns a VHS player anymore. Or even DVD player. But look, okay, okay, okay. I want you to see. I still have left the tags on and again the traditional format of VHS okay so I want you to see the tag okay 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 <laughs> that is this and so I just want want you guys to see the comparison again how cute is this look 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 it's like oh my god a mirror <laughs> This is so exciting. Hold on a second. Oh, okay. So this is the like the official board for the board uh, for the board game. And you can see uh, and I think ideal ideally they've said it, uh, it's great for 4 to 8 um players. And so you can see one word quoted and acted so we'll get into the specifics of that but let's just get into the whole process first hold on a second so we have rules and there's some a little bit of information here instruction how the board game is supposed to look like there's a buzzer you go head to head and then you move on to the second process so here are more explanations again i can link uh videos in the description box so you can have more of an accurate again this is just an unboxing i'm not gonna get into specific specifics but i was anxious to open this up and there's extra rules in the back <clears throat> and then we see the cards head to head i believe that's the first portion of the game and then as you move on there are two huge packs i believe it's like different genres of films so if you've just seen a film because that's like the tagline for this if you've just seen a film or a movie then you would be an ideal player for this and you can see already there's like the genre of action the features die hard and uh, groundhog day for the genre of comedy how adorable, adorable is this? And I believe you're supposed to collect multiple genres with different colors. So again, I'm just skimming through certain information. Uh, there's another little packaging here. It says free mini game inside. And I believe this is another, uh, maybe a preview to another board game if you're interested herd mentality and here we have here we have i believe you're supposed to this is a, the oh remember when we used to have our membership cards this is adorable look at that blockbuster oh and it's supposed to go on this sign it goes on here and then you place the little stick with the blockbuster sign and it has a little um you know for you to place your stick and I believe a stand a stand and then I believe um, you are to place this so that it looks like the traditional parking lot of your local blockbuster video store rental isn't that cute this is adorable this is so adorable and I got this on sale too because of Christmas so again <clears throat> what can't you do you look i know we're all moving into the whole social media interactive but sometimes you know it's great it's great conversational pieces so that you can talk to your family talk to relatives you know if you're awkward uh, you could just you know bring out the game and it should bring 
a lot of memories to your heart to you know to to the forefront hey right? remember when we saw that movie remember when we saw this other movie and it just like engages people and it, it starts conversations so i believe this is the buzzer this is cute too um and it has like i've heard the sounds before i obviously have to get batteries for this because it's, it's not going to beep without the batteries but it has like a sound where it sounds like you're in a car and it honks it's so cute but look at that blockbuster buzzer this is all super cute you get some some stickies from the company big big potato games i think this is adorable and anybody who's a movie fan or fanatic and you remember the golden era of rentals at a blockbuster this is going to be an ideal an ideal present and game this is this just expands expands the typical uh game board night you know what i mean like as opposed to again the traditionals yes we have scrabble we have um i don't know connect four which is always fun and uh and twister and whatnot that uh, candy lamb monopoly but this is cool like i mean 